Hi friends, welcome to Jani's Fantasy. Today we are going to see how to install WordPress in local host or local server. For installing WordPress, mainly we need XAMPP application. On my last video, you can see how to install XAMPP on local system. First open any browser and go to google.com. Then type WordPress and hit enter. Then you can see the search results. Click on the first link. Then you will be redirected to WordPress site. Scroll down and you can able to see the download link. Just wait till the download finishes. The download is now finished and I copied the download file to my desktop. Right click on that file and extract it. Open the extracted folder and copy all the files. Don't skip any files, copy all the files and go to your SAM folder. Currently I am installed the SAM in my C drive. So go to go to the particular SAM folder. Then open htdocs folder and create a new folder. I am naming it as WordPress. You can put any name and paste the files here. Now we copied everything to the SAM folder. To install the WordPress, run the SAM server. Ok, now open any browser and type localhost slash the particular folder name. Currently, I given the name as WordPress, so I am typing it here, localhost slash WordPress. Yeah, select the language. Okay, in the next step, yeah, we can see mainly five things. Database name, database username, password, database host, and table prefix. These five things are mandatory for installing the WordPress. So first, we need to create one database open a new tab and type localhost at the right side you can see php my admin click on that enter database name here i am just giving test 01 create it you can see no tables present in the test 01 database ok again go back click on let's go here we need to put database name then the username password you can leave as blank because by default the password is null database host as local host table prefix you can leave as wp underscore itself click submit then click on run the installation in this window here you need to enter the title of your website I am just entering as Janice fantasy username and the password is automatically generated copy the password some, somewhere else then uh, enter the email then click on install wordpress yeah the installation is now complete so we can log in here first enter the username and the password here click on login this is your admin panel of your website we can check the website also from here click on visit site Yes, this is your front end. You can customize this. And now we can go to the database section. Currently, there is no tables. Reload this page. Yeah, you can see newly created tables here.
now we successfully installed wordpress in our local system that's all friends in the next video we can see how to install the wordpress themes and plugins thank you